What is up everybody and today we are going to take a look at the sand rock. The sand rock what? So that's the question and it is the sand rock U61W because there's no identifying number right here for the product. It just says sand rock and it doesn't say that uh, you 61W anywhere on here that I see. Um, no. Oh, there it is right there. Item number. U61W on the bottom. Usually, you know, on these things, they always play, put it right across here like that, but uh, not this one. Anyway, this sand rock looks like there's some kind of new player in the little toy, uh, in the little toy grade doing some rebrands and some stuff like that. But, uh, I mean, the quality uh, seems not bad. So, why don't we get it out of the box and check it out. Alrighty, so there you are out of the box and uh, yeah, it looks nice. I think Potensic made one similar to this a couple of years ago. Uh, mine was really bad from what I remember. I don't think this is exactly the same, but it looks pretty close, you know. Might have made a couple changes on it. I remember the one I had, the Potensic one like this. The flight time was awful, okay? Uh, from the one I had, everybody else's seemed to be good. Mine would only go for a couple of minutes. But anyway, here's the quadcopter itself. Um, the camera, it tilts. Um, if you look underneath here, you will see uh, the QC label and... What I thought was an optical flow sensor, but it's not. There's the on and off switch on the back. Right there. Then they give you two batteries with it. I'll put a link in there if you want to take a look at it. They are... Oh, I'm having a hard time seeing. This writing is so small. 3.7500s, right? There it is on the gray label on the top. 3.7500s, they give you two of them, give you a manual, give you a phone holder, and then give you uh, this bag that has the normal uh, stuff in there, spare props, the charging cord, and the little screwdriver, and the uh, prop removal too, tool. So anyway, it uses the uh, Flying C app, which uh, has been around for eons. That app has been around for a long time. So there, there's the app right there. Blank C. So it's been around for a long time. Uh, at least four years that app's been around. So why don't we turn it on and bind it up. Turn the on off switch here. There's that. Turn this on here. So, and this takes uh, four AA batteries right here. So that makes this weigh a little bit. So we'll fire the app up. Okay, so there it is. It's UDIRC Wi-Fi. And that would be the, the, the original quadcopter that used this was a UDIRC. They used that app. I remember I had one. I sent it to uh, uh, DeAndre. I sent him that little thing. Okay, so when you fire up the app, they give you a little operating instructions. So, then it goes here, and then this part will come up, and then it goes to the helicopter or the drone. We want to go to the drone. It wants to access the photos and all that good stuff. Okay, so there you go. There it is. Let me show those flowers like I always do. The fridge. The fridge has food in it today. I went shopping. Okay, so there you go. Yeah, it's great stuff. Great stuff. You know, that's, this is, these are the kind of toy quadcopters I mess with now. I don't try try not to uh, mess around with those those GPS things anymore. I'm just so fed up with that that uh, the words can't even describe how sick of those things that I am. These are much more fun than those things those frustrating things so anyway here's a little template card for your uh for the controller you know your normal stuff's on here 
you know, take off land, headless mode, photo, video, you know, the normal, the usual suspects, right? Why don't we turn it around and take off just for a minute? I'm not going to shoot no video in here, but I just want to take off for a minute uh, off the table and then we'll, uh, we'll see what it, uh, how it acts and stuff. So what we'll do is we'll just take it off here for a minute and then we'll uh, take it off outside. We'll go outside and fly it because it's, it's definitely an outside, uh, outside flyer, you know. Here's the takeoff and land button. Well, let me see if I can do the level calibration. There I did it, down to the right. So it did that. So let's just hit the takeoff button. Okay, so it's got three rates. And that's held by this. It's getting running into its little prop wash there. Okay. Stop gonna have stop uh Yeah. Good stuff. Let's take it outside and fly it. it. Seems pretty stable to me. We're out here with the sand rock. There it is. It's a classic. It's a legend. <laughs> and we're gonna fire the app up. I have the um, recording started already, the screen recording. So we're going to try to fly this thing a little bit. Let's uh, start the video up. I'll put the flight time in there also. Allow access. Okay, so it's recording. So let's take off. I see like tons of lag in the video, okay? Let me slow this down a little bit. I don't think this thing does flips, to be honest. No, that's the trim, okay. It's got that seam of trim where you hold this in, hold this in and move the stick this way and that way. But it is, it's pretty stable, but it doesn't do any flips. And the video has loads of lag in it, but you know, I don't care. I didn't buy this for the video anyway. I bought it to, just to fly around. See how it is at flying. And so far, it's flying pretty good. Very maneuverable. I just hope the battery lasts more than a couple of minutes. Because my other ones didn't that were, I guess, maybe knockoffs. Or this is a knockoff of them. Or I had the Potensic one that looked like this. And that was... Uh, the battery didn't last two minutes three minutes tops so let's just hope we can get more out of this one let's check the first rate here to see how a yeah I guess it's very sluggish there's not much pitch at all on it takes forever to see that takes forever to make a turn See how slow it is? I could run faster than that, okay? <laughs> Believe me. <laughs> My old ass could run faster than that. Let's get to the second rate. Okay, so now you see it's picking up, picking up speed. Yeah, but the sand rock, it flies great. Okay, let's, let me make that clear. It flies great. Now let's, kick up the third rate now it's going okay so you see that that's a lot faster
has a very slow descend speed. Very slow. Wow. It was even in the third race, so. Okay, so let me bring it back here and straighten it out. I think the trim might have got a little out of whack over there. Yep. Okay, I straightened it out. All right. So anyway, yeah, flies great. Very nimble, very quick in the third race. Now, I don't think the video is going to be anything to write home about, to be honest. Because I keep peeking down at that screen, and I keep seeing lag. Okay, loads of lag. But hey, you know what? What really matters, right? What matters? What matters is how does it fly? That's the only thing I care about. That's the only thing you should care about. All this other stuff's just gimmicks. If it doesn't fly good, it's no good. I don't care if the camera, or I don't care about the gestures, I don't care about the, the finger wagon and all that other crap. If it don't fly good, it's no good. Period. Methinks the battery might be dying out because it's getting very. jittery. So, I don't know. There's no flips on here, so I can't test it. There is a headless mode, which I don't want to test. Okay, we don't want to go there. <laughs> a little bit of breeze just, just kicked in there a little bit, so maybe that's affecting it some. Because it seems like the steering has really went kind of south. <laughs> Yeah, it's starting to drift away and stuff, so I don't know what the heck's the story with that. It's a toy, right? Okay, so I think I got it straightened back out. That little bit of breeze came up, it really affected it. So, and I mean, it was very little. It was almost like blowing on it. Okay, so. But what I will say is that it flies good, so. All right. Whoa, so the battery's going dead. You know that. That's why it's dropping down to the ground and doing all that stuff that it wasn't doing when I start. There goes the warning. I'm going to stop the video. Save the video. All right, guys. Let me bring it back. What a grab, right? Let's shut that damn thing off. I don't want to chase the customers away. <laughs> All right, guys, there you go. The sand rock. Yeah, man, it flies great. Wow. Flies spectacularly. So, yeah, I'm digging that, no doubt. What did it say on that battery? 14. What, what, what was that left? 14%? I don't know. There's a little thing there. It says 14. You guys see it flashing. I know you do. So, all right, so that's it. The sand rock. Very nice. Flew great. I mean, you know, I know what the video is going to look like, and I don't really care. So, I mean, I'm not doing this for video. All right, guys. Have a nice day. I'll talk to you later.